New at 6, we are hearing from the grandmother who held a chase suspect at gunpoint until deputies arrived to arrest him. It's just another day. If, uh, if something happens, you take care of it, and that's it. That is how this 75-year-old describes her encounter with a man on the run. Way 31 Scotty Kay sat down with the gun-welding grandma who says it just wasn't a big deal. That's right, Nausha. Thanks to a brave grandmother and her hunting rifle, chase suspect Cameron Powers is now behind bars here at the Limestone County Jail. I walked out and said, uh, could I help you? He said, yes, ma'am, I'd like to use your phone. That was the conversation had between 75-year-old grandmother Marcia Black and Cameron Powers, a man who had been on the run for several hours after crashing a stolen car on E&L Lane near Black's home. I mean, I was just calm as can be. I knew what I was doing. I was in control. Black talked to Powers from her front porch, all while holding a rifle. I wanted to keep him at a distance. I didn't intend to kill him. I just wanted him to think that I would. Would shoot him. When Powers inched closer to her home, Black reacted because two of her grandchildren were inside watching after calling 911. He wouldn't get down, so I shot in the air, and he realized I meant business, so, so he got out on his knees. It wasn't long after that deputies arrived. He feared the deputy more than he did my rifle, and he jumped up and ran zigzag right across the field. But he didn't make it far before he was put in handcuffs. That's just amazing to me that I got to witness my grandmother in action. Now Powers was charged with auto theft and attempting to elude. Marcia Black is the mother of Limestone County Commissioner Jason Black. Reporting live in Limestone County, Scotty Kay, Way 31 News.